explode on me was that not crazy <laughs> it went all over my face that's okay right eating my new favorite snack strawberries yogurt and chocolate chips i have been up since five this morning don't ask me why i don't know why i have no energy because now it's 12 and so i've already been up for like seven hours Is that correct? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That is correct. Okay. Good job, Alex. Well, I'm going to teach my students today because it's Tuesday. It's a normal, normal teaching day. Tomorrow, though, I'm doing something kind of weird that I've never done before. I got this call two weeks ago from this like commercial director and he is hiring me to teach someone to play cello in a commercial that's being shot tomorrow. And I was completely honest with him. I told him I have never done anything like that before. And he laughed and thought that that was funny, but I'm a little bit nervous. I guess Bill, I'm teaching him to play the cello but it's only gonna be for 10 seconds and they're not gonna use the sound of the person who I'm teaching to play the cello. Like there's gonna be a speaker playing the actual piece and he's going to be like faking the movements, if that makes sense. And I only have like 15 minutes to teach him how to do this. So a little bit nervous about that because if you've ever played a string instrument before, you know that even simply moving your bow in a way that looks believable is a hard thing to do. It's a very, they're very hard instruments. And I know I'm a violinist. My instrument is violin, but I also teach people beginner cello. So that's why this guy called me. But, um, I'm also a bit stressed because the shoot is tomorrow and I got the message today that the call time is 7.30 a.m. and it's in New Jersey and so I have to take the train there and like I'm going to have to take the 6 a.m. train because if I take a train later than that, I'm going to get there at 7.30, which doesn't work, because that would be me getting to the train station at 7.30, not me getting to the set location at 7.30. So if I take the six o'clock train, I get where I get to the train station at 6.40, and then I have like an hour to get to the set. Like the times just don't work out, and honest to God, don't even get me started on the New Jersey Transit. Don't even get me started because I'd be here all day. Yeah, so I'm a little stressed about that because if I'm taking the six o'clock train, I have to leave my house like 30 minutes before that. So I'm gonna have to leave at 5.30 a.m. I am just starting to get a little bit stressed out. And I guess I'm gonna be on the set from 7.30 until 11. I'm just a little bit stressed. Um, all around, all around stressed. So, yeah. I like can't really, I don't, I would say what the commercial is about and who's playing the cello, but they didn't tell me that I could do that. So I don't want to like say it. When the commercial comes out, I'll tell you guys, but I'm too scared because I've never done anything like this. I'm in showbiz. Maybe this will be my big break. And I'll be a commercial star. I'm just kidding. Anyways, that's where my head's at. Just 
stressed. So I'm gonna eat my yogurt and berries. <laughs> I'm almost done with it actually. And then I'm gonna head out to teach. I am stressed, <laughs> clearly. I am stressed. You know what? What's the worst thing that could happen? new blushes and I kind of want to because I'm growing this one as you can see it's pretty old and used and I've had it for a really long time I should probably get a new one so maybe I'll try out the road blushes plus I love the peptide lip treatment I don't get it all the time because I hate that I have to order a lip gloss like it's just I, sh I hate that and I hate like it paying for shit like it's just not like easy. It just feels ridiculous ordering a lip gloss. But they're coming out with new shades of the peptide lip treatment and I really wanna try them because I do love the formula and the colors look really nice. So maybe I will, I'll let you know. Using this thing, the brown one, the brown part on my eyes. know what I'm gonna wear today. I think it should be like comfy cozy because I might get my period and that won't be fun at all. God, my cramps hurt. Now I'm using the center one. I love highlighter. There is nothing better than having like all the time in the world to just sit and do your makeup. Take your time and then like pick out a cute outfit and go sit down at a restaurant with your friend and just talk and have like a fun drink and some good food. Oh my God, in the city, there is literally nothing better. Now I'm putting that on my eyelids. This pimple, like I have like a tub of all of my fun earrings. These are my grandma's, there are these like little hearts here. These are cute. Maybe I'll just look different. Maybe I'll do, okay. I'm gonna go think about what I'm wearing and try to manage my cramps because they hurt. I'll see you when I'm getting dressed. Bye! When I first moved here, um, I had all of these bags, I had like three of them, and they were all my grandmother's, and they were like this shape, and I used to decorate them with like charms and scarves, I stopped doing that because I felt, I don't know, I felt kind of silly and I heard it's back and I am really excited because now I can dress my bag up again. So 
first of all, I have this very special charm. It was for my 16th birthday. I went on a trip with my mom and she bought me this from the Met because I really liked it. So I am going to hook it on my purse. Cute. Outfit number one with my bag, the cute little charm. What do we think? Every time I turn the camera on, the sun goes away. I'm not kidding. Okay, what do we think? Outfit number one, I really, I really want to wear my little flip flop heels. Oh my God, it would just literally be so adorable. Maybe I should just suck it up. Maybe I should just suck it up and wear my super cute heels. What do we think? Is this bad? You know what? I'd like to think that um, I have it in me to wear a tank top and not be self-conscious of my arms. I like to think that. But you know what? I always am because like, the rest of me is like, the rest of me is like pretty small. And then I just feel like my arms are like ginormous. I hate how negative I get about my body sometimes. You guys like my nails? I just did them. Want me to show you the color I used? Here. It's called Swoon in the Lagoon. Like your Paloma? Honestly, it's like very complex. <laughs> Can you expand on that answer? It's got like a complexity to it that I can't expand on. <laughs> so, cheers!